I made a brand new smurf account in Apex to get into the easiest lobbies in the game thanks to skill based matchmaking. Now I didn't want to be that guy who just went pub stomping right away because I didn't want to get kicked out of the bot lobbies, so I made sure to tone it down a little bit, but I gotta tell you, these new players need to be in their own lobbies because they just don't have the game sense that a season 0 veteran has for example. And I don't think it's fair for them if they're just starting to learn the game for the first time to be thrown against the pros and this is where I think skill based matchmaking is really important. So the way SBMM works in battle royales is that whenever you queue up for a game, SBMM is gonna pair you up with players that are around your skill level to try to make the lobby as fair for everyone as possible. So the good players are matched up with the good players, and the less good players are matched up with the bad players. The problem with SBMM in games like Apex and Warzone is that it works a little too well sometimes, and it feels like the game is punishing you for playing good, so that means that streamers can't be pub stomping in their lobby so easily. And for regular players, it's hard to see if you're improving at the game because the moment you start doing better, the game is just gonna keep pairing you up with tougher opponents, so it's hard for you to gauge any progress. In my case, I've had days where I get two to three good matches in Apex, and then something tells SBMM that I'm playing too good to be playing in these lobbies, and then for the rest of the night, I'm just getting destroyed by these crazy gamers. So if you want to have a chill gaming night, it's like playing good is not the way to go. So I played in these newbie lobbies for a while and I saw some of the weirdest gameplay, like some of the decision making just wasn't making any sense. And the speed that you saw people playing at was nothing compared to what I'm used to seeing in my lobbies. So my thoughts on skill based matchmaking is that it's 100% necessary for these people that are sort of new to the game more than it is for the people that want to go pub stomping for content because as an above average player myself, I just don't think it's fair for these people who barely understand how to play the game to be going up against someone who has years of experience with the game's movement and playstyle. I personally think that they're more likely to get demotivated from losing so much and quitting the game than they are actually trying to get better. Heck, when I got back to playing Fortnite a couple of months ago, I was so thankful for SBMM because I wasn't getting matched against the building sweat lords and I was playing against people who barely knew how to build just like myself, so it was fun to get matched up with people around your same skill level. So while I think it's fun for the average Andy to be able to pub stomp every game, I don't necessarily think it's healthy for the player base and for the game's longevity. So is it possible to get a better gaming experience for the good players without hurting the new players too much and throwing them into the sweat fest? Well, this is a pretty tough question in my opinion because SBMM works differently depending on which game you're talking about. But if it were up to me, I would probably leave pubs the way they are with SBMM and maybe try to add some extra game modes that aren't affected by it. So if, let's say, you want to have an easy night in gaming, imagine you have the option to queue up against NPCs with adjustable difficulties or have some random deathmatch mode for people to have fun in, maybe. I don't know, I'm not a game dev, so I'm just spitballing here. But let me know in the comments what you think, if there's something you would change about skill-based matchmaking, or if there's anything we can do to improve it. And once again, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't, and I'll catch you guys later.